Hey guys, Lacey and Steve from Duo Reacts. Thank you so much for stopping by. And watching The Walking Dead from the Reaction Couch. Season three. Season three. Season one. Season S Season 11. something. Season whatever. <laughs> season 11, episode three. That's what I meant to say. Hunted. Hunted. Yeah, that don't sound good. Oh. I'm guessing maybe the Reapers are going to hunt. They're going to be hunted well, by the Reapers, maybe? We were left off with a lot of questions. Like, who are these people? We came to realize that they are probably, we don't know for sure, but they're probably the Reapers. Correct. Right. And another thing is, me and Lacey did, me and Lacey actually finished up uh, The World Beyond, so we're caught up on that. Yep. And want to thank Ben for that. Uh, kind we of did not record that. That's just kind of something we did on our own time. Um, to get it done. Um, and we watched with some friends on right. here. No, and I, I, I want to apologize because that was something that we had started on the channel. And episodes, uh, episode one was good. Two yeah. and three, four. There, 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 there were some things I just was like, you know, and I looked at Lacey and said, I just can't deal with this. This is not what I expected. We hop back in. We watch uh, the rest of the episodes up to date. And my gosh, was that... An amazing show. Like the last half of the season. Oh, man. Ended up being really good. We it, both really enjoyed it. So good. Yeah. So good. And uh, so good. <laughs> it was good. So I got a little more, you know, look at uh, the Commonwealth and a little bit about, uh, not the Commonwealth. Not the Commonwealth. The, the, the CRM. CRM. The CRM. Yes. Yes. And it does give you a lot of things to kind of. I, I, I think it's all going to merge together at the end. So it's very yeah. important, I think, to kind of catch up. So if you did give up, just hop back into it, watch it. And I, I think you'll agree when you get to where we are right now, which is the end of season one, wow, is it good? And you'll be ready to roll with us when it hops back on. Right. For season two, which uh, I believe starts in October. October, November, I think. Yeah, somewhere. Yeah. Somewhere in there. Mm -hmm. So yeah. But yeah, um, as far as. Episode three here. I'm super excited to get back into it. Hopefully get to see what's up with these crazy Reaper dudes. Mm -hmm. They look pretty badass and pretty formidable, to be honest. So, Well, if it's if it's any tale, I mean, look at the one guy that kind of got into it with uh, Daryl. And yeah, I mean, he just, like, no hesitation was, like, just blew himself, you know. Right. So, yeah. Uh, <laughs> that got real awkward real quick. Anyway. <laughs> yeah, we're going to hop into the episode. I guess we're just really excited about this episode. Yes. So, Episode 3, let's do it. Oh, her face kind of scared me. Like, Wait, who... I don't know who that person was. Oh, I thought was. that was uh, It looked Aaron. like Aaron for a oh, second, but it wasn't. Oh, my God. I was like... It did... wasn't. Oh, shit. That's Gabe. That's Gabe. You got slipped, but I, I don't know how deep or... Because if it's on the side, it, it, oh, that's not good. That's Maggie, I think. Oh, fuck. Fuck, fuck, fuck. I don't like this dark stuff, man. Like, I look at either. her. Dang, girl. This is some purge stuff, isn't it? Like, <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah. Ooh, these dudes. They you know, to have Maggie shaking like she is, she's seen a lot. I mean, a lot. She's scared of these people, and yeah. she can see it in her face. Yeah. Like, she's the only one that we've really gotten good information about. I'm just still, like, I'm concerned about Father Gabe. Yeah, it looks right. like they got like a good potential carotid area, you know, and he like immediate like hope. Ugh, I'm yeah, hopefully he gets stressed, <laughs> already stressed, it just started. Oh, oh. I thought she got <laughs> hit. I was like, what? This episode's trying to get us on edge immediately. You don't want to talk about it? Talk about it. I think there is. Is she? Like just really feeling the fact the fact that they haven't found Connie yet. It's the only thing I can think of. I'm assuming. Do you ever worry about your mom when she goes away? 
Something we've talked about off camera, like they, their mom always comes back. She's got to come back, right? It's, it that yeah, it's Maggie. Oh, it would have been back. awesome if it was, <laughs> though, wouldn't it? That'd be a shocker. I feel like. Do you feel like that little conversation might lead to? Probably. Why is Maggie by herself? Jesus, somebody's on her tail. You know what? I don't know if they miss very often. Is he playing with her? Maybe they enjoy hunting their prey. I don't like this. With this show, you don't know what's going to happen. Okay? Nice. Little trap. Of course, of course. Freaking ninja zombies like to just pop out at you because they don't make a single noise until they're right behind you. Oh shit. Skull face, skull face. that ninja motherfucker get way up there? Oh, I don't know, but... Jeez. Why does this have to be in the dark like this? I didn't see him, but I heard him, and he was definitely... Sounded oh. like he was running up behind her. Well, he's still alive. Well, How, I don't know. Maybe they didn't cut deep enough? He seems like he's in pain. Okay, so they are scattered. Yeah. Uh oh. Ow. It's a freaking screwdriver? Right in the leg. Oh, so he injured him too, I think. You know what's gonna happen. That mannequin. <laughs> Kill this bitch. Yes. Yes. Yeah. We're okay, okay. He's not stopping. What the fuck? What was freaking suicide bombed himself? Another one. So Alden's definitely gone. Yeah. Alden was underneath him. He just, he just saved her ass. Yeah. I mean, he really did. He really did. Oh, okay. How, did I miss that? Oh, my God. Is that good, huh? Walk. Leah said it was a flash bomb. The plan doesn't change. We need that food. We get to the radio tower, find the supply house, and wait for the others. What if the others are dead? Those people, they just told us exactly how insane they are. We can't be on a road. We can't be on any road that they could use. Then you tell me a better one doesn't scare us all. Right. Okay. All right. You two working together? I mean, I mean, no matter the... I mean, I'm just glad that it was a flash bomb and not a bomb bomb. Oh, a bomb bomb? A bomb bomb. You know, a, a worse bomb. I don't know. Oh, they're just out catching horses, Wrangling apparently. Wrangling them horses. <laughs> Let me tell you how many times that would work for me. Zero? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. You spooked him. I've been having dreams about Abraham recently. Yeah? Yeah, he's trying to tell me something. I know it's something important, something I'm supposed to do, but I can't hear him most of the time, and just when I'm about to, he's shot in the head. 
dark. Yeah. Uh, you start freaking out, but now I think it's a message for us, for Alexandria. Okay, so what's he He's saying? We better get moving. That's... Who, who's that? It's gonna go toward the screaming. Negan. That's it probably what I would say. Uh, you don't look Agatha. familiar. Oh, it's Agatha. Okay. Uh oh. That's a big guy, right? Yeah. Is he freaking hurt? Yeah, going through the mouth isn't really gonna do anything. It worked. Oh no. Is he gonna die already? He's dead. What the shit? Oh, he's not dead. That's a lot of blood, though. I'm so sorry. For all of it. Why? You look good. They are not playing no. games, are they? Maybe you thought this had a happy ending. You've been watching. Again. You've been watching the wrong show. I'm kind of upset though. It's only episode three, and we were literally just getting to know Duncan, and I was really starting to like his character. Like, he's a force. Yeah, and obviously Herschel trusts him, and like, wow. I mean, we didn't even get to really see. No, not. I guess it's. They're really. Oh no. Oh no. Is that, is that a horse? There's multiple of them. There's all kinds of them. Wait a minute. They're like torn to pieces there. Wow. No. Oh. Keep looking for the rest. They'll stay close to the water. Not if it's full of corpses, they won't. Carol, it's getting late. I don't think. Carol's She's willing like, to give this up. We don't have to do it. No, Alexandria needed these horses yesterday. Carol. She's like, maybe she just needs a hug. Well, I mean. Well, there they are. They look, yeah, Beautiful. they look so majestic and very fun. There you go. <laughs> okay, now it's their four of them. Out. He's like, you best be nice to me. You best not bite me. <laughs> Even the horses are like, man, I do not like running around out here. Just take me back home. <laughs> Keep getting freaking my ankles bit on by people. Without my foot. I'm a little slower. I thought you were. Don't be scared. I'm not. Are you sure? I have the lights. Sure. Sure you have. I guess you always come with me. If you pray for me. He's like, you just tried, tried to, kill to kill my friends. Yes. Oh. And they tried to kill me. Oh, after you. Pray for me. Even your enemies deserve that much. I thought you were a man of God. Something's not right. God isn't here anymore. Damn. <laughs> He's like, God took a little vacay. Course, He'll be back later. <laughs> I can help you. Being friends, they trusted me. You were gone for a long time. Things change, people change. Cut them through, but not me. Stop pretending you're one of us again. Maybe you even believe it, but you're probably as good a match yourself as you're everybody else. I mean... Maybe just quit trying for a while. I mean, quit trying to talk for but a while. But your actions. Just, okay. Yeah. Right here, right here. We'll start when we get back, okay? <laughs> She's like, no, don't start that. Don't even start it. That one's been tied to a tree. What's that saying? Ju Jud Judas. Wow. Wow. Oh, they're getting riled up for a reason. Y'all best run. I already suspect they're being followed. It's not gonna make it. <laughs> Oh shit! Ooh, chop that arm, chop that arm off. Oh shit. There's too many. Oh my god. Damn. Oh wow. Man, 
Maggie is losing all of her people, man. That like all of her people that dang. How about not get used to anyone new? Apparent no. Definitely like not. All. No, because they're gonna die, apparently. It's gonna be her and Megan. By the end of this. Yeah, yeah that's what it's looking like. And well, and Gabe, because I think Gabe will be fine, hopefully. I don't know, they're focusing on Rosita a lot too, and she's waiting on Gabe to look, come back. And I was gonna say something about that earlier. They're really like her being, you know, and talking about dreams and right. something doesn't feel right. Right. Is that one injured? <laughs> Man, I don't want to see that shit. What? She's calling it to feed? Or maybe it is to feed them because they have no other choice, but I don't like it. Yep. I'm that's guessing exactly that's horse is. meat. Come on. I don't like you. Just take really small bites. The smaller the better. You've eaten it before? Yeah, I'll go with my mom. You eat what you want. Judith is like, oh. Ever been on the road? It's not that bad. Not like the spiders. <laughs> Y'all <Yeah. laughs> This kid. <laughs> oh, is that the whole, if they let you touch them, their ears, that means they trust you? Yep. Oh. Oh yeah, that place looks totally legit. Not scary at all. I'm slowing it down. Yeah. We're fine. Maybe not. These guys are anything like you say they are. And it's gonna get worse. I'm dead weight. We all know. I'll help you. I don't know why I walked away from him. Yeah. Everything he stood for. He's like, I'm standing right you. here. It's because I trust you to do the right thing. No matter how hard it is or how much it costs you. Supplies of many. Look at me. The supplies. The only thing that matters now. Alexandra needs us to do this. They're waiting for us. Herschel, Judith, you come and make a light down a ladder like this? No. Maggie, if this plan fails, and everything you work for, everything you want for the future, dies with it. The sun is going down. But you don't get to decide who lives and who dies anymore. It's your fault that we're here. Because you destroyed everything that we built. Well, you know. You still have to do it. That was a long ass time ago, too. Come back. She'll be back. You think? She'll be back, but will he still be there or will he still be alive? Is the question. My prediction is no. It's not looking good for him. Symbolism there? Yeah, some symbolism, yeah, with the. Because he swung it kind of like a bat. And... That's it? Yeah. Wow. That was a. It felt like it went by really quick. Like, it did not feel like a full episode to me. Like, I was expecting more to come at the end of that. I felt like we just started. Yeah. Like, we have a half hour left. Yeah. Or something. But, okay. It definitely started off with a bang. Definitely got your heart pumping. Like, at least my heart pumping really quickly got me on edge and then it kind of slowed down a little bit but um i think it was very important a lot of stuff that happened in this episode i'm really upset that agatha and duncan are both gone we literally just met them i didn't even really remember agatha all that well but duncan we had kind of we were starting to get to know him a little bit and definitely was a loss there yeah, he was just getting his feet wet with the group, basically. I mean, on the in the subway thing, uh, yeah, yeah. you know, his relationship with uh, Herschel. Yeah. Um, oh, and Cole is dead as well. He was the one that you thought was Aaron. Yeah. Because the screen was really dark, and it, it kind of did look like Aaron for a second, but that was Cole. So he was taken out almost immediately. Now it is literally Alden is questionable. He's still alive, but... Injured. 
Um, and now Maggie and Negan are both left to finish this mission all on their own. With Gabriel. With Gabriel kind of out there somewhere, but still alive. But hopefully he'll meet up I with them at some sure point. I thought for sure he got hit in the neck. And it didn't seem like that was... It looked like he did, but maybe it missed or maybe it just grazed, maybe. Because he see, seemed like the leg injury yeah. was m- the main thing with Gabe. So, And, and then uh, he catches up with one of them, and, which I'm, I'm really kind of shocked that Gabriel... Yeah, this entire, especially this entire season and a lot of, you know, previous seasons, yeah, he's, he's going. been very, like... You know, especially in the past couple episodes, he's been like, oh, you know, God speaks through me and like, you know, very He's going Old Testament, isn't he? (laughs) He's eye for an eye. He's like, fuck you. God ain't here right now. He ain't looking over my shoulder right now. So you about to die. And then we have, uh, you know, I think there is some traction to what you're saying about uh, hot pants. Yeah, there's, she's been having dreams about Abe. Um, he feels like, she feels like he's trying to tell her something. The last time. Some of the time, shots they had was very, uh, specific. Like, I don't know. Like you could use them in a Rosita death scene. I to don't. To me. I mean, I. I don't think it's, I don't, I'm, I don't know. I don't know. I feel like it's, <coughs> I, I am a little bit worried about Gabe now, even though like, I love badass Gabe, right? Whenever. Gabe pulls out his whole, like, you know, like the first He kind of has that Carol effect. Yeah. You know what I mean? So I really don't want anything bad to happen to Gabe, but I feel like whatever message that Abe beyond the grave is trying to tell Rosita through her dreams, it's got to be huge, right? I think there's some traction. I don't know yet if it's bad thing like a negative thing or if it's a positive thing like this is how you get more food or this is what you need to do to survive or I can't put my finger on that yet but I feel like it's definitely important and I I am kind of concerned that maybe it could involve Gabe in some way I didn't get any more answers on the Reapers other than other than they're crazy and and if they're going out, they're going to take you with them. The one that we... Or try to take. We thought got suicide bombed himself. Apparently that was a flash bomb, but they're they're prepared. Mm-hmm. They're very prepared. And they will hunt you down. They will keep... That's why I'm worried about Maggie and Negan right now. Like, I feel like they're being followed and they don't even know it. You know what I mean? Because these guys are tactically trained, it seems. So what if they're being followed right now and they don't even know they it? They could be. They could be. And Alden's sitting there. In that church. Yes. Do you, I, I have a feeling that we're going to see the Reapers come along and torture him. And absolutely. I, I don't know. I, I just or get that feeling. Or something. Uh, yeah, I do believe they're being followed. I think. I mean, they were following Maggie all the way up to that mall. Exactly. So and, what's to say that they're not still following them and just staying in the shadows right. until their perfect moment, which it seems completely plausible that they would do something like that. But I still uh, need more answers on the Reapers. I need more. I need more yeah. of that. I, I got, you know, I feel like this one was. This episode just went by too quick is the problem. I feel like I didn't get enough fill. Of my film yeah. of The Walking Dead. You know, like, I feel like I needed just a little bit more. With a kind of a head rush right yeah. into it where everything's going on. And and then we kind of, they, they kind of pull back, you know, and then they're looking for the horses with Carol and, and, and the girls and, um, you know, having moments together and whatnot, um, which, which I like, but, you know, okay, I get it. Enough, <laughs> you know what I mean? Enough. Yeah, you, I get what you're saying. I'm, I'm not sentimental in that area. I just, you know, look, I, I want to see things happen because I like badass Carol. I like badass Rosita. Yeah. You know, um, all four of them are a very, very tough group. Oh, uh, exactly. Exactly. And I'm definitely excited for the next episode because it's only going to delve even deeper into what we've been, been seeing so far. I, I'm. Well, what's up with Kelly? 
With Kelly, I feel like it's definitely in relation to Connie and them not being able to ever find her. And the whole what uh, Magna is saying to Carol is like, I know you're giving, you're trying to give her hope that she's still out there and mm-hmm. to keep looking, but I think she feels like it's making it worse because every, what we've seen in this episode, when they went out looking for the horses and some of them were dead, yeah, just, Kelly really took that very hard. And it's like, I feel like it breaks her every time, you know, going out there and thinking about Connie probably in the back of her head, like, I'm you know, it's making her probably a little bit depressed and losing hope. And uh, I hope we come very soon to find out. I don't know where Daryl is right now. He was there, so he must be doing something else. He must have ran a different way. I don't know. We didn't see him, like, at all this episode. We definitely got our fill with uh, Negan and and Maggie. Right. Um, Just when I feel like okay, this could be a step in the right direction. There were, you know, uh, now they have no choice. They have each other. That's it. Now they're going to have to rely on each other. The two people that don't trust each other the most put it together. They're going to have to trust each other in some moments that will probably come. I mean, Negan's already saved her ass once with that Reaper that was on top of her. And he also didn't save her in the subway. That's true. I'm just saying... Now that it's only them two, they're going to have to rely on each other a lot more. I'm curious. To, I, I could have I used more of that. I right. could have used more of them seeing how, how they were going to do this. Well, I think that'll be coming. Oh, for sure. For sure. And, I, and then again, I thought, you know, at the beginning of the episode, the kids sitting around talking about their parents and whatnot. I thought maybe we'd get a glimpse of a, maybe a Michonne. Ooh, I I don't know about that. I feel like that might be a little too early in the season for that. Who's to say anything? But off the we table. yeah, exactly. We don't know. I can be hopeful. When I you see things like that, I you know, I, I think, hmm, maybe. Because they're like, my mom will come back. So I right. figured, you know, Judith, it would have it would have happened. Just I mean, that, that would have been, that definitely would have been cool, but maybe the, she's saying that for a reason, potentially, so maybe in the future, she'll, we, we will see an appearance. I still want to know what happened with Connie. We haven't seen her yet this season, and the last time we saw her, she was being picked up by Virgil on a horse, mm-hmm. and Virgil is also very, like, uh, you know, he... Out of the first two episodes, this one was definitely the... The first two was excellent. Mm-hmm. This one was... I, was I needed more. Definitely good. I'm, I'm gonna definitely be a solid episode, but I definitely was left wanting more. Yeah. Definitely, like, didn't feel like I got quite what... Like, I got what I wanted, but I wanted... I was expecting just a little bit more, I guess, maybe. I don't know. Mm-hmm. It's not putting the episode down because it was a good episode. It was just... It, it made it the gave first me, two were. It gave me weird yeah. feelings because where like, we were left off at the end of two. Yeah, I was like, "This is not." And then this. they started this episode like with a bang, like whoa, like immediately, and then it just like slowly starts dying down until boom, it's over, and I'm like, "Oh, that's it." You know, that's kind of how I felt. Mm-hmm. But overall, good episode. Excited for episode four. Thank you guys so much for watching this episode with us. Please leave a like on this video. Leave your comments and questions down below. Make sure you subscribe if you're not already. Share the video and squish that bell. And we hope you guys all have an amazing and awesome day. Hope amazing happens to you. Until next time and The Walking Dead, peace out.